Imagine you've got a fantastic, luxurious watch. It's really expensive. So you decide to segment your market, get all the right postcodes, put a beautiful leaflet together, and then put it through everybody's front door, and you don't get a single lead. That's a classic example of when the channel has killed the value proposition. You see, if the product was that luxurious and that desirable, you wouldn't need to put leaflets through everybody's front door. They'd be coming to you. Similarly, a budget airline wouldn't want to take a double page spread in a posh lifestyle magazine. So when you're thinking about the channels you're going to use to get to market, it's not just enough to think about where your customers are, but also what's appropriate with the products and services that you're offering. For example, a top consultant cold calling potential clients leaves a disconnect. Why would you be making calls if you're so good? However, offering a webinar might be more appropriate. On the other hand, there's no point creating a white paper on the quality of the business cards you produce. Picking the right channel is crucial in ensuring that your offering comes across as authentic. Otherwise, it really can kill the value proposition.